I'm Joyce Garnett, I'm the University Librarian at Western. Libraries are academic spaces and we try to provide an environment where people will be inspired to, uh, to study and, and to learn, but also a place where they can meet their friends. It's a, a social space, uh, we have a coffee shop, we have lots of places where people can get together. Well, Western Libraries has seven physical service points. Each of the libraries has one or more faculties that they support most directly. There are two libraries that coexist. There's a physical library and there's a virtual library. Western Libraries has 9.4 million physical information resources. We have hundreds of thousands, about 600,000 or so now, electronic books, which has changed the way that people access information. And the students, if we had anything to say about it, they'd want more, better, faster. That's their take on, on technology. So we've made a big effort to provide as much connection as we can in terms of access. Approximately three quarters of what we purchase now is actually in electronic form. So our research resources have increased, the quality has increased, the quantity has increased. It's been an amazing time. The electronic world is very popular and is in constant use, and it's available 24-7. And anywhere anyone is, as long as they have some sort of device and access the web, they can access our resources. In the annual Globe and Mail survey, the students have rated Western very highly, and they've consistently rated the libraries as number one in research university category. Western Libraries has become known outside the university as being innovative and having people who dare to make a difference and take chances and take risks and to experience the change and challenge every day, it's, it's wonderfully exciting to me. When I walk through and I see the students here, they appear comfortable, they appear at home, they, they feel that this is their space. You can feel the energy level, the noise level rises and they, as though they were in their own living room and they're able to do everything they want to do, surf the web, drink their coffee, chat with their friends, and occasionally study and read a book. The students who come to Western are very fortunate. They appreciate the environment, they appreciate the richness of the environment, and they appreciate how much of a benefit and a gift it is to them.